We recently lost a great personality, Ratan Tata. So I would like to talk about him today. Just a reading a passage. I'm calling it embodying resilience, a tribute to Pratan Tata. Resilience in the face of adversity is a hallmark of true leadership. Few embody this trait as profoundly as Pratan Tata, the iconic figure whose legacy continues to inspire leaders across the globe. In this talk, I will delve into the remarkable journey of Ratan Tata, exploring how his unwavering resilience has set a standard for leadership excellence. Born into a family synonymous with entrepreneurship, Ratan Tata assumed the reins of the Tata Group a conglomerate with a storied history spanning over a century. His leadership journey was not without challenges, yet it was his resilience that steered the Tata Group through the turbulent times, transforming it into a global powerhouse known for its commitment to innovation and social responsibility. In the annals of business history, Ratan Tata's tenure as chairman of the Tata Group stands out as a testament to his resilience. From saving the group through economic downturns to spearheading bold acquisitions, he displayed a rare blend of courage and tenacity. One defining moment was the acquisition of Jaguar Land Rover, a movement that showcased his willingness to take calculated risks in the pursuit of excellence. Beyond the boardroom, Ratan Tata's resilience is exemplified by his unwavering commitment to social impact. Under his leadership, the Tata Group spearheaded initiatives in healthcare, education, and rural development, touching the lives of millions. His belief in the power of business to drive positive change echoes a standard of leadership that transcends mere profit margins. margins. Ratan Tata's resilience has not only guided the Tata Group to unprecedented heights, but has also set a benchmark for leaders worldwide. His ability to weather storms with grace make tough decisions with conviction, and lead with empathy embodies the essence of resilient leadership. In a world marked by uncertainty and volatility, his legacy serves as a beacon of hope and inspiration. As aspiring leaders, we can draw valuable lessons from Ratan Tata's journey. Embracing resilience means facing challenges head on, maintaining a sense of purpose amidst chaos, and staying true to one's values in the face of adversity. It is this unwavering commitment to resilience that paves the way, way for transformative leadership and enduring success. While concluding, I would like to read the unbreakable legacy of Ratan Tata stands as a testament to the transformative power of resilience in shaping a standard of leadership excellence. As we navigate the complexities of the modern world, let us heed the lessons of his journey and strive to embody the spirit of resilience in all our leadership endeavors. While I worked at TCS for the first 20 years of my professional life, 
I never had the opportunity to work, meet, or shake hands with him. But I still want you to talk about him today. And I wanted to keep it different. TCS might have been started before Ratan Tata took the baton, but TCS and the group as a whole flourished under <coughs> his leadership. So it had to be IT and or technology oriented talk. All that I have read other than these last words is written by the Wix AI agent, including the 12 shades of Ratan Tata that I'll be displaying soon. I just gave a command to the Wix AI agent, Ratan Tata, Tata and Resilience, and have not touched it at all. So I've read exactly what the AI agent gave me. While these 12 pictures are not real, I'm going to show those pictures soon. These are relatable. Just a command Ratan Tata to the Wix AI photo generator and each picture was generated in less than a minute. While concluding, I'm going to share those pictures. This is how it came out. Each picture is, a, is not a real photograph, is generated by AI artificial intelligence agent from a Wix platform, but we can relate to each of these different shades of Ratan Tata. So I'm saying 12 shades of Ratan Tata. A great personality, our salute to him. If you have any question about this talk or about a resilience as a whole, please feel free to write to me and I'll be happy to respond. This is your host, Daman, Daman Dev Sood, logging off from my weekly show, My Top Tips, every Wednesday, 9.30 a.m. IST. And I look forward to seeing you all next Wednesday also. Bye-bye.